one and a two and a hey fatty boy what's up everybody welcome back to those hard motherfucking feelings baby i am your host this week kevin james ryan coming at you from down here at tutty's basement but you guys are the motherfucking homies and you know that not even the homies you're a fucking ten dollar homies twenty dollar homies fifty dollar homies you guys are top tier homies top brass baby uh, my co-host coming at you in a nice seafoam uh, polo shirt. Knockoff. No, I that's presume. cotton, dickhead. U.S. Polo Association. What is that? What kind of brand are we looking at? Because there ain't no little guy on a horse on it, I'll tell you that much. Harbor Bay. And I wasn't ready before Hell, we you, started the broadcast. You smell way. like low tide. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, H. Foley. <laughs> Cheers, everyone. <laughs> <coughs> that cackle from behind the camera coming at you is the one and only T-Bone McMuffin, Toby McMullen. What's up, dudes? What up, T-Bone? Toby McMullen. Their shirt does look like that foam that gets on top of the surf when they have to shut it down for E. coli. Yeah, Dude, I called, don't like that. It's called sea foam. That's uh, Calvin, not Calvin Wait, Klein. is this the color? The color. It, so pol- actual polo, Ralph uh-huh. Lauren. Lauren. Ralph Lauren. Ralph Lifsch- Lifschitz. Is that his real name? I think so. Ah. Um, I could be wrong on that, but I might be, or maybe that's Jeff Ross's Jeff Lipschitz. Something. I'm about to take a Lipschitz. Uh, <laughs> um, I believe it's called Seafoam Green. Is that color F- from Polo? Yeah. Hey, Merle Street. <laughs> There's less mustard stains it's on fucking it. Fucking Harbor Bay. That's what it is. I'm, I said you smell like low tide or something. Right? I already made that joke. Yeah, it's pretty good. Whatever. I, my mom has a bunch of shirts that don't fit my dad anymore. You're in your dad's clothes? Yeah. Like a fat eighth grader? <laughs> it's a 4XL. I'm down I'm down a size. Oh. Yeah. I saw it. <laughs> I'm ready to tell some kids to get off my lawn. <laughs> <laughs> you better hope it's not contagious. <laughs> I got to catch this, am I? <laughs> this, is, this is like that commercial where they're like, don't be like your parents. Yeah. Real heebie G. That, that commercial. Dude, the par- they're talking about the parking alone on this place. It's great. <laughs> Everybody loves those. Oh, they're the best. They're all right, man. They're That's all right. That's a good piece of business over there, Progressive. Don't flow to beat it. Uh, I got a little bit of news. What do you regarding, got? Regarding uh, the outfit. Not, My outfit? No, the company. Okay. The company. The company. Uh-oh. Woke up the other day. Yeah? To some... Charges on our card that were not authorized. Listen, dickhead. I took my fucking niece to lunch. She told me I could. I'm not it was t- less than a hundred. No, I'm not talking about you at the Blue Bell Inn. Trust me, I know. Fuck. <laughs> this guy's all over me. Sixty-two eighty-seven. <laughs> see, I don't like that. I don't like that. I want to see it too. I want to know where you're going. This is fucking bullshit. <laughs> How I had it? a salad. How how is the claims casino, Fatty? Yeah, holy shit! <laughs> I Jesus I called him. I called him requesting an itemized breakdown. Like a dealing with Jack Reacher over here. This is <laughs> fucking <laughs> terrible. You're calling, asking to talk to the server. Look, buddy, he wasn't authorized to tip you thirty <laughs> percent. I'm gonna I'm gonna need eight bucks back. <laughs> That's I did leave about 35 percent. <laughs> I used to work there. Uh, that's not what I'm talking about. Um, Toby. Was it a bunch of skateboards and trucks? Knee pads? Um, Did you ever hear a kid call them Nebo pads back in the day? (laughs) There was a a real suspect kid in my cul-de-sac. You got your elbow pads and your Nebo pads? No, that's that's real real fucking dirt factory (laughs) shit. Nebo. Um, He pulled up the charges? No, I no, not those charges. Those are fine. I told you, of course. That's your, you know, it's your company card. You're allowed to use it for company. You were talking. We're hiring your niece as an intern or something. I right? was talking shop with her. Yeah. Okay. Jeez. Christ. <laughs> it's nay on the axes, Tay. That's <laughs> gonna come back and fucking bring this whole his whole system down. I, Dave Becky was also there too. <laughs> and the guy from Lionsgate, Stan something. Um, <laughs> Stan Lionsgate. Johnny Lionsgate. Um, <laughs> what? What's going hold on? Hold on. Sorry. I'm, I'm in the middle of something. My fucking uh, my wife is at the bank and she needs something. Oh, my God. We're fucking screwed, Toby. I knew it. Uh, no, 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 no. Hold on. Just give is me she one. even your wife? Welcome back to T-Bone and the Fatty. Yeah, <laughs> shit. On a much lower production budget. <laughs> 
Holy Sorry, shit. Sorry, just give me one second. She's at the bank. It's a thing. She's jammed up. She needs a marriage certificate. A marrow? What the fuck? What kind of bank asks for a marriage certificate? Um, Jesus. She had to recently change her name. All of these, you got to prove that why she changed. She's changing her name? She already has. Really? She's Nadine Kippy? <laughs> <laughs> Nadine Bald, little dick guy? Um, it's a hyphen it. <laughs> Whatever, I'm back. Okay. What's going um, on? Typical broad fucking thing. She's like, never mind, I found it right as I said it. I'm Forget like, the broad. Who, wait, who's in our account? What's exactly. going on? So I, I log in. Is into, it Russia? I log into our. <laughs> Outen, I'm sorry. <laughs> I log into our Chase banking uh, institution. All right, we're talking about the blue card. Not Amex. Yeah. Okay. And I see. Because uh, no, I was home all hold weekend. On. No, yeah, yeah, no, no. Trust me. I got I got a homing device on you. You're fucking doop, doop. You're like sonar. <laughs> Stuffed an air tag in a fat roll. <laughs> <laughs> if you check behind your ear, there's a tag number, ZX14. <laughs> um, I got it. Oh, this, uh, this is a story. This happened so long ago because we've been, we've been moving and shaking with, Mr. S- with Sir Louis C.K., you know. Um, so we're a little. Uh, Sounds like you've been absconding with some funds. No, I wish. Try to, try, well, man, it I'd sounds be like fucking robbing you idiots blind if I didn't have a soul. Um, if I didn't have a soul, I would. If I, yeah, if I didn't have one, I would be robbing you blind. So you do have a soul. Yeah. Whew. Okay. For What's now. going on? <laughs> um, so I get an email. Uh huh. From Uber Eats, which. Okay. Cause you don't. All right, so for the listener, Foley doesn't. Foley has a credit card, a company credit card. Yeah. Proper credit. Yeah. I have the bank card. Right. Right. The real juice. Um, the real mother's milk. I could do more damage with the Amex if I wanted to. Uh, no. I can always claim that as stolen and I'll replace the funds <laughs> real quick. Get me hemmed up in Bogota. Um. Let's see. Sorry. Um. So I get an email. Okay. From Uber Eats. Do I have it attached to my account? No. Okay, because I was—I just checked, and there's a. But I was pretty sure this wasn't that card. Okay. Oh good. man, you're both fucking suspect now. I, I don't mean, know who to trust. I thought maybe we had ordered out on the road or something, and it got put into my shit. No, uh, no, 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 no. So hold on. I forgot how good this. I forgot the the layers of this. I apologize. Let me just get my uh my my stuff. Bearing up. straight. Yeah. Get your story straight is what it fucking sounds like. <sighs> Where the fuck? I'm hooking you up to a fucking polygraph. This is egregious. <laughs> I just fucking got a new lease, goddammit. I feel like Sal and the boys are in the other room. They're in your ear. <laughs> Somebody get Murph. <laughs> I was talking to Mr. Volcano earlier today. Shout out to him. What the fuck? Where is this, man? This is fucking killing me. Hey, you're bozoing this up. I know. What? I, I'm sorry. It, it's. Uh, I want to have my ducks in a row because you're going to ask 5,000 fucking questions. And I want to have you all my... You get your lies straight. That's what you want. What'd you get at Uber Eats? I didn't get anything. Yeah. So I wake up. Where the fuck is it? Tuesday. So I wake up at an Uber Eats. And, uh... <laughs> Sorry, bear with me. I woke up in a bag full of popcorn shrimp. <laughs> I didn't know what was going on. <laughs> We're vamping, folks. Vamp it. Vamp, 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 vamp. Jesus. Sorry. Fuck. I don't know why it's not searching. It doesn't come up. Because this whole story's a sham. <laughs> yeah, that's why. You're fucking lying. <laughs> See, I would have had fake emails, fucking fake references, the whole nine yards. Hard to keep the plates spinning under the bright lights, eh, Baldy? What's that? <laughs> huh? Take you downtown, find out what you fucking know. Sick the dog on you, yours. I'll tell you who looks great right now. Who? Hank. <laughs> this guy, I mean, you lie without breaking a sweat. <laughs> Buddy, I'm lying right now. I'm not even wearing a seafoam shirt. That's how good I am. It looks quite soft. Thank you. All right, so what's the date Very here? Nice. Fifth. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we're broadcasting I'm here, trying, man. man. Tell Toby to fucking cut it or not. What are we doing? Just hold on. It's just fucking give me a second. I'm sorry. <clears throat> I'm okay. Everybody's okay. The homies Ex- on the other except hand. Except the people who stole from us. Mm-hmm. Which would be? Uh, oh, whatever. So I, 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 I just... You're killing me here because you're breaking my stones, but I got to find it. Okay. So we get, I haven't found it. I get, I, I get an email from Uber Eats. Your, your, your Chipotle order. Me? No, just listen to the fucking email. If I could read the email, if you weren't fucking breaking I, my you balls. You got to understand, I'm back, backtracking the last 30 days to see if I did anything wrong. It's not you. You're in the clear. Really? Well, 
I'll go I'll go over the Amex charges shortly. Um I get an email. Mm-hmm. Hey, your order has been delivered. We're gonna need to see that email. <laughs> Hey, unfortunately, I'll get also, fucking. Yeah, I'll on. get Liz Cheney in here. She'll get to the bottom of it. Yeah, just wait. I, honestly, just just hold it. So okay, I, so I have it. We're um, gonna jump cut to the magic of cinema. Where the fuck is it, man? I forgot how deep this went. <laughs> <laughs> right, see, now we got to put that back in. Tell Luke, mark it down. <laughs> All right. You find it? I get an email. The problem was it wasn't. Okay. Hold on. And we're we, back. We got to jump back in. Yeah. You ready? And we're back. Kibby just said that he has nine different emails. <laughs> I just I want do. that put out there on record. I do. <laughs> well, I have the are you garbage? I've... If anything happens to me and Toby. I have three. That, I have four. Was, that was like me and Foley just got yelled at by the teacher, and they were like, the next person to laugh gets fired. We're trying to be respectful and quiet and just giggling. Yeah, for the, for the, for the homie out there, we've been sitting here for about a half an hour. This bozo <laughs> fucking digs up his lies. <laughs> fucking emails, laptops. What the fuck? So I get an email. So th- uh, this came in we, Thursday. We were in the studio last. When me and you ordered Chipotle last Thursday, uh-huh. right? And I, so I wake up Friday and I have an email it says your Chipo- this is from Chipotle. It's been delivered. And I'm like, that's weird. I'm like, why is it coming in a day late, you know, or whatever? So I'm a uh, fucking new guy. Luke's all over me. Dude, you stink today. Uh, <laughs> it's new guy Luke's first full t- for full time day. He's Yay! been blowing me up like crazy. Well, he's got plenty of work to do on this episode. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Fucking spit it out. So it goes, your Chipotle order is in. Uh-huh. Daniel. And I go, mm. this don't fucking, something's up here. So I start looking. And I'm like, maybe it's Foley? You know, I don't know. Like, you know, that's like my first thought. But then I'm like, oh, no. Of course it is. It's not on my. What'd he get? Uh, well, I got it all. Nice. I have the man's address. He got it delivered to his house. I have the address. Let's go. So I it's sixty one fifty. Did he get the extra guac? Sixty one dollars and fifty cents. What? That's queso money. <laughs> this is ridiculous. He got a steak burrito, white rice, black beans, guacamole for three twenty extra. Uh, he got one burrito, two burrito, barbacoa, barbacoa bowl. Uh, let's go to his house. He tipped three bucks on it. I got to give him that, what though. What a piece of shit. It was a $61 order. But used our, used our debit card. How do you get the... I don't know. All at Chipotle.com, but it somehow got... He must have hacked my... I'm thinking of this now. He must, but why did I get the email? Do you think he's the hacker? Somebody hacked my Chipotle account, I guess, that has our debit card saved in it, maybe. Wow. Fuck. You can't because fuck. why I got the email. If he just had my, if he just had the credit card information, he wouldn't email me and tell me he's doing it. Right. What a bizarre way to use that elite set of skills. Mm-hmm. I, that's what I'm saying. Wait, hackers get hungry, though. You got to give them that. Maybe, maybe it's just he constantly does that. But but with the address, I don't know. The back door to these it's, fast casual servers in, are wide open. It's, it's where? Woburn, Massachusetts. Cocksucker. Those dirty, dirty. We're calling the FBI. <laughs> Gas up the Kia, grab a Cobar. We're going on a road yeah, trip. Yeah, no shit. Give, it a, give that address a Google. I have it. I have, dude, I have the street number. I have does it say one, he, two, three, Mockingbird Way. Does fucking, it say he lives there? What do you mean? No, does it say, like, no, if you Google it, if you Google the number, the address, uh-huh. does it come up Daniel fucking Alacoa, whatever? Oh, we're going to do a little catfish here. Yeah, we should. I was thinking if we just go to his house, but that's just me. Did he put a phone number to call on the order? Ooh, let me check. Let me oh, get my th- God, please, for the love of God. Hey, you fucking, we can't call him. We'll fucking get into our phones. Yeah, that way, then we're all fucked. Yeah. That that's not that doesn't work. Yes, it does. They did it to my mom. They didn't. She lied to you. She did other stuff. 
that you can't just get, answer a phone call and they hack into your shit. We're going to get to Patty in a minute. Oh, uh, wait a second. <laughs> what? So this is the address to the Chipotle. Yeah. Ah. Your delivery. Oh, no, no, I'm sorry. Yeah, I have his. I do have his. I do have his. We got a case cooking here, gang. Uh huh. This is I forget. This is why I wanted to give me the time. This okay. is real juicy. All right. I told you it was juicy. Oh, all right. Case. All right. All right. So obviously, I'm not going to say the address. Why not? I don't know. What if it's not him and I'm, we blow him up and they fucking and Alex Tanello goes. <laughs> <laughs> Can I talk to you, you <laughs> cocksucker? Shit out of some guy. <laughs> Tanello, put it away. <laughs> Uh, Holy shit. Yes, let's see. All right, fine. Um, That's what you do? Man, I don't trust any of these things. Damn, it's an expensive house. You're stealing my it's fucking $900,000 house, and you're stealing my goddamn Chipotle Holy money? shit. How do you think he paid for the house? He's probably a kid. It's probably a fake name. His parents It is, there. I think, currently for sale, maybe. So maybe he just got it delivered. He's out front. Like, it's not his real address. I don't know how these people Damn, operate. that's pretty fucking good. For a fucking... But all for For fucking... a burrito bowl? <laughs> I know. Are you kidding me? That's crazy. This guy's got a switch car. What a fucking loser. <laughs> He's a dude doing the drop. He's in a parking garage somewhere. <laughs> Sweeping up hairs at the barber's job. I had a switch car three times. <laughs> hey, man. You could have reached out to him. would have bought you lunch. He's got, he's got the... He's, he... He's got the nun mask on and a fucking AK. <laughs> He's covered you in never a Nissan fucking show me. Covered in Nissan and kerosene and thrown in a road flare. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Watch it. <laughs> All right. So you got this punk's address. So huh? I got the address. Did you hold on? Did you are there any other charges? So that's another thing. So Jesus. I caught Jesus. So about I, to be a murder charge, I'll tell you that. Right, what do you get? What do you get for breakfast, this fucking piece of shit? I pull up uh so I'm like, all right, you know, uh, so I, right away, I'm like, oh, I'm fucking start scanning. I'm like, I don't know who the fuck spent this. This is about this. What's this charge? What's this There's charge? There's a couple on So there. I call up fucking Chase. I start, and I'm like, you, this is someone's using my card. Freeze the card. They freeze the card. Mm -hmm. Chase freezes the card. I go, all right, we'll send out a new one. I go, I can't go to a Chase and get one printed. I live right next door. They go, no. I go, well, when's it going to be here? He goes, 10 business days. I'm like, the fuck? How am I supposed to pay for it? I'm like, how am I supposed to run a business without a credit card? He goes, if you need any money, just go to the bank. Like, go to the, I'm not going to the bank every 15 times a day. <laughs> He's like, you live right next to one. <laughs> I can, sorry, I can see where you're calling from. Can you at least get me some Chipotle? His order was pretty good. The Daniel Dirtball meal at Chipotle. <laughs> like Jack Arlo. What did he get? There was two meats on there. <laughs> no, there was multiple. Uh, where was it? Uh, let's see. What did he get? He got a steak burrito. Hold on. A steak burrito. Mm -hmm. Okay. 16 beans. Right, yeah, you they sixteen bucks for the steak beezy. Uh huh. Oh, that's guac and all that. Then he got the pollo asado burrito. Uh huh. That was fourteen eighty. So this is a whole crew. He ain't eating all this food. You think one guy's big enough to pull this job off? No way. Shit. <laughs> There's a whole system of Man. probably some fucking sleeper cell in on this thing. Holy <laughs> feds are probably in on it. <laughs> They've been fucking planning this all month. Oh dude. no shit. This whole thing's been a setup. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> One guy's going to rip me off. Okay. Man. I'm the prince of fucking Park Avenue, baby. King of the motherfucking Fuck, boards. See, we're on people's radar now. I don't, yeah. I'm going off the grid. You think some fucking dirtbag in fucking Woburn, Mass is going to fucking rip me off? All right, so we got two burritos. <laughs> so we got hit by the Woburn bandit. <laughs> <laughs> going to have been fucking Wapo. What, what is it, Wapo? Uh, so we got two burritos. And a barbacoa bowl. They probably split that. <laughs> <laughs> That's to pay off the cops. A little bit of walking around meat. you know. And I mean? that was delivered to that address. Delivered to an address that I have. That we, I mean, we have the address. Mm -hmm. See if we can get a number on that, a phone number. All right. Nobody's got landlines anymore, and they, they usually guard them online. You have, to pay, you have to pay a service to get the number. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, what the fuck, man? What a piece of shit. Property records. Now we're talking. Yikes. You want to hack? I can hack, too. <laughs> no, we can't. <laughs> www.hacker.com. As soon as, soon as I remember I my password, you're fucking dead. As <laughs> soon as I find my correct email address, <laughs> yous are all done. Holy shit. Kevin um, Ryan all right, so what Kevin are the Ryan charges? Two. I do have a name. Or 140. Whoa, okay. That's not it. 
That's my social security number. <laughs> Two nine nine. Man, you, you fucking stink today. I'll tell you that. This guy's all fucking all, all thumbs. thumbs, all forehead. All right, thirty six records found for someone who lives at this address. Yeah, age twenty three. That's probably that's prime hacker age. Yeah, yeah that's hacking. Go play Fortnite, fucking nerd. Probably yeah. listens to the show. Probably knows. The you deal. think? Yeah. If they listen to the show, I'd allow it at that point. No? No. <laughs> Start freaking out. <laughs> uh-uh. <laughs> Don't rob me, please. Um, so I assume they hacked my Chipotle. That's it. Chipotle's got to hear about this. Their firewalls uh, compromised. What's that all about? So was there, was there other charges? I just searched uh, if there's been a leak at Chipotle. It's just people complaining yeah. about shitty burritos. <laughs> My bag's leaking. It's the goddamn guacamole. You didn't put the lid on correctly. <laughs> Piece of shit. You didn't put a lid on my fucking Diet Coke. I hope they forgot book. something, Daniel. <laughs> yeah, I hope they gave you a regular Coke instead of a Diet Coke. Yeah, I hope they screwed shit. you on the fucking cutlery. Didn't give you silverware, yeah. Pussy. Eating with a, eating, we'll try to eat that with a chip. <laughs> <laughs> that alacoa is heavy. Whatever it's called. Alacoa. <laughs> Barbacoa. Alacoa. I'm Paul Alacoa. <laughs> yeah. And I'm a hacker. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, okay. You stink. So I start rolling through the charge. I'm like this, this, and then I realize they all are valid charges. It's just all like our Uber Eats and Uber. <laughs> you know, the fuck we're down here at the Good Time Cafe and all this stuff. I'm like, I didn't fucking have this. I didn't have a, I didn't get coffee right next to the studio. Um So it was just one charge. One charge for sixty one fifty. Yeah, they probably roll I mean they probably just have thousands of those cards. They use it, try keep trying to use it. I assume it but like it's Pretty nuts that we have. He's brazen. You want I'll to hear something that. nuts too? Okay. The name, yeah, is Daniel Ryan. <sighs> the plot. It it's an inside. It's an inside job. I assume this is my thought. They got. I was maybe they hacked in. I don't even know if I have a Chipotle account. I assume I do. Did you at any point? Order food for your brother and people? No. And maybe it was saved it on his but phone? Ba- why, why would he be in fucking outside Boston? That's what we'd like to know. <laughs> Daniel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I've been from Boston this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> you flocky quack sake. I tell you what, you sold the Philly accent really good. Okay. 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 So. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody wants to play hardball. <laughs> All right. So I assume it was some sort of like Yakuza deal. What do no, you think? like you know when they when these things get hacked or compromised, you don't get all of the information, right? Like it, like some of it comes like you get the credit card number and not the name, or you get a portion of the name and whatever, whatever. They could have been, they could have been like, oh, it needs I got to put my name Kevin Ryan in to for you know, and they just guessed Daniel or found out that my brother's Daniel or something. I don't know. Hmm. Or you're in on it. I'm in on There's it. There's only three options. Yeah, and they were barbacoa, steak burrito, and pollo. What's your usual order over there? What? Yeah. It's not barbacoa. Over. I don't touch this stuff. <laughs> I swear. It's all over you. Um. <clears throat> so what do we got? Let's 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 be serious here. So we got an address. I got an address. Where it was delivered to. Yes. You don't have a phone. You don't have his phone number. Let me see. Um, order details. It's yeah. just that payment method. Kippy's credit card. <laughs> <laughs> Some fat loser's card. Um, yeah, that's it. There's no other. There's no number. No contact number. Where does this guy live? Barbacoa, Massachusetts. <laughs> <laughs> On the right next side. side to right off Guacamole Lane. <laughs> <laughs> Your order is in Daniel. What is it? What is it? It was eight thirty six p.m. Mm-hmm. On six twenty four. A lot of carbs that late at night. <laughs> That is pretty late. <laughs> Probably a couple big boys we're playing with here. <laughs> Probably a couple of heavy bikes. <laughs> you know what? Dan, enjoy the burritos. <laughs> hey, I've what seen if, all I need to see. What if that was all just for him? 
He's like the liver king, fucking <laughs> fucking calorie loot. He's really been pushing liver king yeah. every episode. <laughs> yeah, well, every every casual conversation, you somehow get back to that guy too. What was the what mass shoot Whitman? Uh Woe Burn Mass. W O Burn. Hmm. Wow. See if there is a Daniel Ryan in Woburn, Massachusetts. Owner Carpenter, Daniel Ryan Carpentry. Whoa. Whoa. That is a that is a common Irish dirtbag name. In yeah, Wo- I got 158 Dan Ryans in, in Woburn. Yeah, dude. They're probably all in on it. <laughs> yeah. Um but Chase did reverse the charge. Took Good. a couple of days. Uh-huh. Lost interest on that. Fucking screwing me every way. <laughs> every way they can, they're fucking Send screwing. Send some extra me. napkins or something, will you? Okay. Um Let's go to the street view of this. Let's see this. Daniel J. Ryan, Woburn, Massachusetts, 105 Westgate Drive, apartment three, 87 years old. This is our guy. (laughs) It's probably his grandson or something. Hello. It's like Whitey Bulger all over again. I'm on the street. I got the street right here. You said it's an apartment. No, that was a different address. What's that address? I think it showed me the wrong house or something. I don't want. I don't know who to believe in this. I don't know what's going on. I think this is it right here. Fucking dirt bags. Should go fucking firebomb the place. Ooh, that's nice. Wait, but it's, so it's a house, not an apartment. I don't know. I never said it was an apartment, did I? I thought you did. You said apartment three. I said that. Yeah, no, oh. I didn't say that. But I was just trying to hide the lead of him being eighty-seven. Hmm. Our other, our other strongest lead is one hundred and one years old. <laughs> Probably got nothing to live for at that point. So he turned to a life of crime. Those old people steal. You know how they you know those old people do? Retire, start coding. Yeah. Like, like, <laughs> really Brooks, and, like Brooks and Shawshank yeah, yeah. Like wanted to rob the grocery store. All right. So maybe I'll rob a bald fat kid from <laughs> Pennsylvania. Order a couple burritos. That'll fix them. Are you Woody from Toy Story? I was doing Brooks. I thought that's that actually pretty right, accurate. Yeah. I'll give it to you. Um... All right, let's see what else can what else can we find out about this? Seventy. I'm not really getting. There's nothing listed on that. I don't even think this place. I don't even think this is a house. Should we actually. dust the email for fingerprints? <laughs> Guacamole all over it. Nothing on it. Piece of shit. They got us. I don't think there technically is a hundred and forty six block of this street though. He probably waited on the corner. I see a 144, a 148. Oh, man. This goes deeper than I thought. This is a mysterious episode. So, we got got. The yeah. good people over there, Chase, took care of Shout it. Shout out to them. You know. What's Chipotle saying? You talk to them? Nah. Kind of just once they gave us our 60 bucks back, it kind of just folded. We could call them Chipotle. <laughs> And his, any suspicious characters hanging out around there. You want to call? <laughs> yeah, any guys with masks and sacks with money signs on them? <laughs> <laughs> Anybody with an old-timey gun, by any chance? <laughs> Anybody going, yeah, a lot. <laughs> hey, give me the burrito, you see? <laughs> What's the curly Q mustache situation? Um, <laughs> I'm going to tie this broad to the train tracks and get a burrito bowl. I sh- That's enough, Toby. Chipotle Mexican Train tracks was grill. okay. Yeah, I mean, I think, you know, how many people do you think he's doing this to, though? Probably a lot. Probably every fucking meal. It's floating the taxpayer's dime. Piece of shit. But where, how the fuck did they get my email address? Well, you're not fucking the Pentagon. I know, but it, uh, why not, if you got, why not use someone else's email address? So they have my card and my email address. That's what I'm saying doesn't make sense. I don't think I have a fucking Chipotle. Oh, maybe I do. Let's see if I can sign in. Chipotle. He probably changed your password. That's the first move they do. But it was to an obscure account. It was an obscure. Uh... An obscure account. What Email account. And I'm in. Wait. I'm in. I do. We've heard... It says, hey, Daniel. Let's go. What the fuck? Let's go. Let's go. How, what do I do from here? I need to see. Uh, let go, me to, see go, to a, go to account. <laughs> I'll take the chips. <laughs> <laughs> I need to see a menu quick. <laughs> go to, go to account. Get a couple of tacos. Holy shit, over. it says, hey, Daniel. 
He's hacked into your Chipotle account. He is you. I got 489 points. And technically, he owns half of the podcast. <laughs> and unfortunately, you Daniel? for that reason, you're out. <laughs> you got to do a podcast with Daniel, right? God damn it. Um, whoa. I feel like I'm in someone else's house right now. Go to. He's in your house, dickhead. Fucking make it's, a move. <laughs> Everybody hit the ground. <laughs> <laughs> what do you got? Nobody move. <laughs> what do you got? Not that I have 489 points I can redeem for a fountain drink or a side of guac. Not the Chipotle. <laughs> what do you want? You want the drink or the guac? <laughs> I know I'm going to steal a water cup. What do you know about the <laughs> perp? <laughs> what are you doing? I'm going to steal a water cup? Nothing. Right, he's probably doing that too. Yeah, we didn't order a drink. How yeah. you eat all that chip, all that fucking Mexican yeah. food? I'm not? gonna get something. Let me use the bathroom <laughs> first. I know this kid's mo. Pick up from, and it's one twelve Commerce Way. No, a pickup. Yeah, that's that. That's the, the closest store is one twelve Commerce Way. So that's where he. Let's so, map out the store to the to the address. Triangulate him. Yeah, let's let's Toby, go back to the scene of the crime. Toby, get my whiteboard <laughs> <laughs> and my red yarn. This is about to get wacky. <laughs> and my cheese board. <laughs> Keep the energy up. Get a bottle of wine too while you're at. <laughs> Wait a minute. Did Hold the on. kid have it delivered, or did yeah, the kid it, pick it, it delivered, up? Delivered. Delivered. All right. But I want to walk in the shoes. You know what I mean? It Dude. could be right around the corner or something. It could be an inside job. Who even knows? That would make sense. They're just making dummy orders, sending them to a fucking vacant place, and everybody's laughing on my dime. If you work at Chipotle, would you, you get just... sick of it? Yeah. Just... Who knows? People are sick. How high does this go? Yeah, no <laughs> shit. Pelosi's probably in on it. Um. All right. Crazy. What? I don't. I mean, my. I don't want to suggest this, but it could be my dad. He maybe moved to Boston and stole my identity. No, why would he do that? He wouldn't be able to do that. He doesn't have a hack. He doesn't. He doesn't even have cable. I think he's got a flip phone. Yeah. If you, well, if you, if you well, go, we if won't you, rule him out. If you go under account, what is... 10-minute drive. From where? From the Chipotle. It was a 10-minute drive to drop off Daniel's food. Mm-hmm. Okay. So it's within a 10-minute vicinity. This is a, if you take Commerce Way to Wildwood Ave. Well, how Wildwood else are you going to get there? Whoa. 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 Or H. Foley Boulevard. (laughs) (laughs) Do you make a left on McMullen Way? He's in a band called the Boneheads. What the fuck? (laughs) Okay. All right. I pushed it. Yeah, you did. (laughs) So did Toby with the tracks line. I was vamping. <laughs> <laughs> what is vamping, by the way? Let's fill in the. Oh, you know, like a band vamps, like. Tss, yeah, 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 yeah. You're yeah. filling the dead air. Yeah. yeah, plenty of that in this one, folks. Fucking <laughs> Johnny Computers over Hey, it, it paid off. This is a fucking. We're hot on the trail right here. Oh, I okay. feel like Neve from fucking Catfish. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, if man. you if you go under account, mm-hmm. it'll it should have like address saved. And perhaps contact information. Chipotle Mexican. And a photo. My bag is empty. Hey, Daniel, I click on the account. Uh, view points history. Extras, my rewards. A profile. Edit profile. I'm looking, man. Payment methods. Well, you. <laughs> yeah, he's got my fucking credit card. It's safe. Had it. It's canceled now. Oh, it is canceled. Hope you're starving. That's going to jam us up some. can have up to two credit cards or debit cards. <laughs> He's got both of them. If you, if you, oh, 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 oh. my mom. If you throw, throw something random into the cart, and then when you check out, it might have whatever information he gave. You should, there should be edit profile. In this. I'm in edit profile. I'm in payment. Options. And there's no phone number, contact number. <clears throat> All right, Daniel, that's me. Uh, favorite uh, save delivery addresses. We have the studio. That's the only one saved. Fuck! Now he know he knows where we are. Whoa! Yikes! That's not good. No. We're gonna find this son of a bitch. I'll tell you that right fucking now. Throwing him off our scent. Yeah, and definitely getting. Chipotle What's your phone number? Lunch. Huh? What's your phone number? No. <laughs> you nuts? Are you on a VPN? What are you working with over there? 
This is all from when Kreischer put his water on, got a water I on know, the I know, he fucked everything up. And nothing's been the same since. I don't want to say nothing. <laughs> Leaked it. That's how the pickpocks do you. They bump into you, and they grab your shit. I saw yeah. one the other day. Guy distracts you, you look this way, and then they snatch your chain. Oh, that was in the club. Yeah. I seen that. Huh. There's no information. What do you got for us? Nothing. I got nothing. That's it. All right. <laughs> Sounds to me like Chase Bank needs to be chased down some goddamn leads. Well, all we can do now is turn it over to the cold case, and uh, who wants to contact the family? Let's see. Favorite in recent orders. Sits. He only did it once. Still fresh. That I know of. Trying to live it. Two orders, 624. To this address? No, it's 7 8 2021. That was me, probably. Yeah. Chicken Bowl. <laughs> yeah, that's me. Yeah, that's Kippy right there. <laughs> no, Chicken Bowl, Chicken Bowl, Chicken Bowl. I didn't get that. That was probably us three. There's no way I ordered three chicken I never bowls. get chicken from Chipotle. I think you're in on this. Or what if you have some type of split personality thing? Who goes to Boston for the weekend? And orders casual dining. <laughs> and probably kills a couple homeless guys. Could be. Man. Daniel Ryan. Huh. Probably not his real name. I would assume not. He probably... Could it be a robo? Could it be a robo situation? Yeah, but then who, but yeah, like all this stuff is like you get the money and a deposit or you buy something to get shipped somewhere. But like, this is like, the food is perishable. It's not like you can just like, someone had to eat this food. You would assume. I think we should call the cops and have them do a fucking drive by at the house. See if it shakes anybody up. Where is I Wilbur? think we should go and we should do a drive by. That's at least ask around. That might be for Patreon. Let's go fucking track these pussies down. I'll borrow should. someone's gun. God, we don't gotta close. Relax. We're not gonna kill him. I mean, these are probably dangerous guys. No. You take the car. Take the new car. It's north of Boston. E. Could be the eye ties. Dines. Achi, achi. Whatever. We do have it. connections up there. Who? With the Boston Police Department and the FBI. What? I'm trying to in case he's listening. <laughs> Fucking idiot. I, I mean, know the governor. <laughs> Of Chipotle. Sure. Well, that's it. That's all I got. Uh, you know, we'll see how this shakes out. I'll track some leads down, shake some bushes. Go We're going to do it. a little investigation off air. Definitely want to see if we, I'm going to do a little poking around. Okay. All right. How far away is it from here, from New York? Um. Because right before we leave to get in the car, I'm going to call him and you know what I'm going to say? Run. <laughs> and then hang up on them. To Chipotle. <laughs> I don't think there's an actual address to this. But it that, looks, what, it looks about four hours and 20 minutes. If you want to take I-84, do you want to take CT-15? Wait, what do you mean? CT-15, I'm not paying the tolls. All right, four Wait hours, 17 minutes. What do you mean there's not an address? You said... You... It, it doesn't show up... It doesn't give you an actual... Is he playing stupid? Is he in on this? What's going on here? <laughs> he has a little touch in the head. I'm saying it doesn't give you an actual... Uh, look, I'll show you. Why does you, it... You pin down. Let me fucking... Where did they deliver the food to? I wasn't there. <laughs> or was I? <laughs> that's where we start. The look, but I'm saying it's not falling. Here's 144. Here's 148. Yeah. There's no, like, it's not falling on anything. It's probably a, a, it's probably an apartment complex, and he lives on the corner. What? Yeah. He well, lives in, it's that house right there. But the, that's 144. It says 144. Fuck. That's what I'm, that's what I'm fucking saying. He comes out to the driveway. Let me get up on Zillow. He comes out to the driveway. He gets He's just the food. standing there. Oh, you Chipotle? Yeah, I'm Dan. Mm -hmm. Probably got a big head, real good looking, <laughs> like me. What are you guys doing? Good cop, stupid cop? I've seen this a thousand times. <laughs> Nothing comes up on Zillow either, I don't think. I handcuff myself. <laughs> this is you son of a bitch. You better start talking. It's I probably the Russians. I've been running my mouth. Yeah, so that's 144. I don't think 140. That's 144. That's what I showed you. I don't think 146 exists. Probably a Harry Potter type deal. Yeah, probably. Secret probably. house. Huh. Well, well played, Daniel. <laughs> you got me. Dead to rights. Change your password on your Chipotle thing. 
I don't even know how to fucking do that, dude. You, you, you just opened the account. You just got in there. I didn't. <laughs> I'm going to need the credit cards moving forward. So you can go to the Blue Bell Inn and spend your $38 at Emerald Park. And don't think I don't see that. What the? <laughs> Damn, they got me. These fucking cocksuckers. All right, forget about this post. All right, I forgot. You guys want anything while I'm here? <laughs> <laughs> we should get lunch. I mean, well, I'm not going to lie. Yeah. I got a hankering for some fucking sweet corn salsa. You know what I mean? <clears throat> Picked up a new whip. I, saw, I was just in Big Black. What are you calling it? Big Boy. Big Boy. Yeah. I was just in Big, big boy. boy. No, it's the Hank Tank. The Hank Tank's pretty good. It's Big Boy. He wouldn't like that. He's angry. Uh, the wiener wagon? <laughs> <laughs> no. He's intimidating. He's a bull is what he is. Okay. He's a bull. Mm-hmm. You don't take any, any shit. What? Who are we talking I about? I saw you. Was fucking, I saw everybody. Rickshaw cut you off on fucking 6th Avenue. I don't have to drive fast. I drive slow with him. He cruises the block. You don't drive fast. Everything comes to you when you're in big boy. It's a good car. That's nice. So go, I, give us a rundown. I can't afford it. I know. <laughs> Why you were throwing some numbers at me, sir? And uh, Woo! MSR we'd have to add enough to second hard feelings every week. <laughs> I gotta say, I don't love that you got a car because <laughs> it's in your name, and now I got no leg to stand on when I'm trying to trash you. Oh, good, 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 good. Yeah, you're finally a 50 year old. Good, good, good. It's regular not tag losing. and title, bitch. Come see me. Yeah, well, <laughs> the repo man plans on it. Yeah. <laughs> it's probably Daniel Ryan. Yeah. <laughs> I'll need that wampum address. Whatever you got. You're going to be parking that fucker sideways in your garage. So here's the deal. <laughs> Backing in. Here's the th- Can't read the plates from the street. I done that, son. You want to talk about trash? <laughs> Putting bushes over it. So One of those nets. <laughs> the camo nets. So the drones don't see you. Like a real psycho. So here's it's the like scoop. A swimming pool from up top. <laughs> so, they Whatever. used to do that back in the Groom Lake. They would do that shit. They would like paint out the fucking uh, planes to look like different planes. So when the Russians took pictures over top, it looked like just a regular plane. Cool. But really, it was the B one bomber. Okay. Turn your lights out with those things. It's your nickname. B one bomber. Mm-hmm. Anywho, not a bad name for the car, but it's big boy. So my lease was coming up. The lease was in my mother's name, even though I was paying for it every mm-hmm. month. All right. Um, Debatable. <laughs> Debatable. <laughs> Full price. Who knows? You know, I mean, if you were making the payments, mm-hmm. you wouldn't be able to not to be able to afford this one at the same time. Just saying. What do you mean? What do you mean? Well, that lease is over. Sure. Yeah. That lease is over. Yeah, but it's not like you went from a Kia to a Ferrari. You went from a Jeep to a Jeep. The right. payments should be relatively aligned with what the previous payments were. They weren't. The previous payments were three hundred dollars. This one's your mom paid five hundred <laughs> of it. <laughs> this one's five. Uh huh. This one's five. But okay, so here's the deal. So uh, the car was go ahead. No. Question. The car was uh, the car was up. the The lease was up on the car. Mm-hmm. Okay. Lease was up on the car. Um. I could either buy the car, turn the car in, get a new lease. Obviously, we're changing it over into my name, put it in my name. So I had a Jeep Latitude. Okay, for some reason, if I wanted to buy Laddie, all right, it would have been like $634 a month. I might buy it and just fucking drive it off the bridge. It would have been crazy. It would have been crazy. And if I got a new lease of that car but a newer version, it would have been like 700 Something with the chips in this one or different than the chips in that one, but it worked. We got out. Doritos in this guy. We got Fritos in that. <laughs> and everybody knows I'm a cool range man. <laughs> hey, spicy, spicy nacho, nacho, or I'm walking right now. <clears throat> so I had a purple one the other day. All right, that's spicy nacho. No, no, no. no that's sweet chili or yeah, something. Yeah, sweet like chili lime or something like that. We were just talking. We I think me and T Bone just gave this rundown. Stop, stop the deal. On the old Garden State Parkway to Sonoco. The Dorito is all right. That's you know what else really was not else. to shake a stick at that I haven't had in a long time? Pizza combos. They're all right. Oh, the original. They're all right. So that wasn't started. the original, was it? Yeah, it was. Pizza combo. Wasn't it? The original combo. I think we've done this. We're in reruns. Okay. Danny! I believe it was. It's a clip show. <laughs> so, listen. Let's cut the bullshit. 
All right. Original. Who combo. are you texting? I'm asking who the original, what the original combo was. All right. So that was the situation with the car. Mm-hmm. Okay. Those are my options. So it turns out that next year they are redoing the body or whatever of the Jeep Jank, Jeep, Jeep, Whoa, Hachi Machi, Jeep Grand Cherokee Limited. Okay. Which is what I got. Mm-hmm. So they're trying to get rid of them, I guess. So Stink. I was able to get a 2022 Cherokee Limited, as I said, mm-hmm. at the dealership. Okay. Lease. Mm-hmm. At 10,000 miles a year, it's five bills a month. Okay. And the insurance wasn't too bad. Okay. And I asked most, I asked a couple of my cousins, I asked my brother, I asked other people, is that a real, because I don't want, I don't want to live outside my means or whatever. You yeah, why well, I mean? start now? <laughs> <laughs> they all said, yeah, that's about right. That's about right. For what I got. Okay. That's about right. And there was literally no other fucking options. It was either I get that one or I get the fucking the thing. They, there's no fucking cars. They don't got cars. Nah, you yeah. can DM Kia. They'll give you one right off yeah. the shop. Apparently. Off the rip. Get it off your Used Chipotle Apple Pay. account. <laughs> <clears throat> well, I don't want to drive a Kia. Mm-hmm. Kevin. I'm an American, goddamn yeah. it. So you decided to upgrade from your mom's car to a car you can't afford. So here we are. Yeah, we are. Uh-huh. Yeah. So- I should be okay. This is the phone call I received. I should. How much is your insurance? I should be okay with that, right? That's only nine grand a month. I should be able to spend that. I don't know what these humans do. I don't know how to fucking be an adult. I don't know what it is. This guy could have been telling me anything I want to know. I don't know. However, there was an incident at the dealership, unfortunately. Now, I had to bring Patty he, he along. He probably wrote me into some fucking appearance as well I have to make. <laughs> hey, you got to do the company. We got to do the Jeep Christmas party, okay? Put you down <laughs> as a reference. On the cuff. <laughs> it's outside. Hey, listen, I'll do 550 a month, plus me and Kippy will come down every Christmas for three years, do the party. <laughs> do a christening. I had to bring Patty with me because Patty had to get, Sign a, for you? get out of the lease and turn it over to me or something like that. I can't remember how how it all fell down. You guys are like ticks. Mm. Yeah, we are. And dude, she was so panicked cuz like they're giving her a check that she has to take to the the bank and drop it off. off the bank. And yeah, she didn't want to she she's like I'm just just tell them my brother's like just tell them the fucking wire. She, I don't trust that. So so we fucking go there to pick the car I'll up. Take mine in cash, please. And we go there two separate cars. What? Yeah, we took two separate cars to get there because as soon as she got the check, she was splitting out the door to get to the bank because it had to be there a certain day. But it really didn't. It was like they give you like a 10 day grace You're nuts. We get it. So we get there. All right. We get there. We sit down. I got the insurance. Got this. Got that. Got that. Um, but going back when we first went there, to- I, I imagine you guys walking into the dealership. You're already fighting, and there's some fucking car salesman sipping his coffee, going, "Ooh, back to time to make some money." Yeah. <laughs> I just want to have a fucking bullseye on your head. <laughs> About to take these poor bastards for everything they got. <laughs> Keys. See, right, Terry, this is what is known as generational suckers. <laughs> <laughs> I see from the big one. <laughs> They're all bozos. Ooh, sweet Lord. You see the way the parents are fighting? That means the son's retarded. Is that your girlfriend? No, nah, it's my mom. Bingo. <laughs> That's all it took was a little charm. You a 46-year-old man walking to a Jeep dealership? That's clear code all day, baby. <laughs> Never mind. I was going to insinuate your mom had sex with the dealer like that scene in Forrest Gump where he walks out and goes, oh, your mama sure does care about your Jeep Grand Cherokee, boy. <laughs> but I didn't want to be an asshole, but anyway. She might have. <laughs> so let's go back to when we to when we were when we were window shopping. Did he take your mom out for a test drive, too? <laughs> hey, let me let me go. get a let me get a 55 whore. <laughs> go, go play with the radio. Um, when we went there initially, okay, so we go over there. Uh huh. This is last week. I yeah. Picked, I picked it up on Saturday, so this is going back last week. I, I, I forgot. So <clears throat> we go there, try to do some business with these gentlemen, with this gentleman. Um, like gypsies. <laughs> <laughs> so we meet behind a Kroger, and uh, so we pull in. I give him three teeth. We pull. We pull in. He checks out my car. Ba ba ba. This is what's going to be. That's what. Eddie word on a Bernie's in there. 
Not a fucking word. And I had just stepped in gum. <laughs> I did. Or no, you know what happened? Not bragging. This is why you cannot buy used cars. Oh, you God. do not know what's yeah. going on in there. Oh, my God. <laughs> Woo, hope you like buggers. Because you're they're... driving one. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Literally. Shout out to the latitude. It's very sad. So I had. Uh, it's happy not to have you fart yeah. in it. What are you I, talking about? I, the best days, of his, the best, best days of his life are ahead I, of him. I sneezed like two weeks ago when I was driving and I was chewing gum and it flew out of my mouth. <laughs> I, was, I think I was on the highway or something. <laughs> you and, are another and, and kind I, of idiot. I dude. said I was going to get it later, uh, and yeah. I forgot about it. And it was re- been real hot, and so it melted into the carpet. So I noticed that when I pulled, I, and I thought he was just checking it out. We were, I wasn't looking to cut a deal. You weren't look, you weren't ready for like the 16, 68 point inspection. It's first what? date. No, I'm not trimmed up. A couple, I, how you doing? Yeah, yeah a little crowd work first. Yeah. So immediately he goes out and fucking takes a look at it, and I mean it's been, it's fucking that thing was built in Heater City. Mm-hmm. It's fucking cooked in there. Yeah. Throw on the summer AC. To really bring it out of the pores. I know. I know it. I was in the Woo-wee! car no more than a week ago. Cooking. Didn't give a fuck. Yeah, they, I'm sure they just fucking chemical bomb Yeah, they that. denogonize it or whatever the fuck yeah. it is. But, dude, and they're so hard up for cars, and it's this whole fucking thing. It's wild. The whole thing is fucking wild. So he's like, all right, we like the car, you know, whatever. We'll take the car. You know what I mean? So what you want to do is, you know, two options are this, that, the other thing. He ran some numbers on the fucking latitude, on what the new latitude would be. You know, I'm like, ah, I can't really do that <laughs> fucking. And, and, but that, the car that I have is the car that I would have regardless of how much, and if, if I was a billionaire. No, it's not. It, I'm telling you, I fucking. You're saying that. I'm, tell, I under, I'm not saying you don't, but you also don't know what you don't have. I don't know, man. I, I I don't think it gets any better than the fucking Jeep Grand Cherokee. That's what I like. I'm not. I'm not are you sure. I just thought that's an insane statement. I'd I mean, like, I get a helicopter, maybe. Sure. But I wouldn't drive it. But this is also like the H Foley logic in the sense of like it's what you're maxed out. It's what you could afford. You you, you turned a joyride in a Bentley into a personal attack on me. Very true. How? You've never been in a Bentley, have you? <laughs> I forget. What was the record on that? <laughs> but I'm just saying. I'm not. Be that as it may, I'm, I'm very dis- happy with the vehicle. I'm, I, I assure you are. But this had, to me, this is the, this is, this, I know you pretty well. This reigns all true to the Disney thing of like, Disney's fucking stupid because you can never go. Mm-hmm. And then you're like, I don't need anything else. This is all I need. I'm not saying you don't love it and it's great. It's a, it's a fantastic vehicle. Are you trying to get out of the fact that I'm crazy? Yeah, but to be like, that's what I would drive if I was a billionaire. It's like, you would for sure not. All right. <laughs> Whatever. Don't say that in front of Big Boy, though. Get pissed off. Um, I don't know, fucking. Here's the sitch. It like almost that. didn't happen. You don't say. You walked in and tried to get a lease, and it didn't go smoothly. No, it didn't. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'll be calling NORAD. <laughs> <laughs> so we go in there. Everything looks good. Do you want this one? Do you want that one? I'm like, listen. I love this. This is like actually the car that I would prefer. I just didn't think I'd be able even to, if I was a billionaire. I didn't think I'd be able to afford it. He's like, you know, the prices are different because the you know they're changing the body. They're this, that, the other thing, whatever. Okay, so they run my credit. All right, I instantly get a. Fuck- I think we have the same credit now. By the way, I instantly get fucking hit up by Credit Wise that my fucking score dropped just because they they're you. poking every, around. Every time they every time they do a hard check, you get dinged. So now the guy that owns this place is friends <laughs> with a real dirtbag. Is is friends with my mom's like they're almost like my cousins. A- at any point during the negotiation, did you say, "Come on, it's me"? There was no negotiation. Which I, uh, looking back, I should have said, "Can you do any better?" But I think he was doing the best he can and doing us a favor anyway. I don't know. Should I have said that? Can you do any better? I thought it was what it was. No, I think it's, it's not over. Casablanca. Is there room for negotiation? Always. Fuck. Sucker. I wonder why. You getting... walked in and paid fucking sticker price? No, I paid whatever he said it would come out to. No, he paid sucker price. Yeah, we didn't even pay sticker price. Damn. Hey, what do you charge me? Well, sir, it's going to be 1400 a month. All right, thank you. Shit. Car's orange, too, which is strange. No, nothing. I want that cut. Um, <laughs> All right. I, he's half in the computer. Where are you going? Nowhere. 
I'm thought, just sweating. Thought you were leaving. So he runs the credit check. Uh huh. All right. I get shot down. Whoa. Shot down immediately. Now I'm in there. Fucking, I, I, I went outside to have a smoke. I'm fucking tense. That really makes your case better. <laughs> fucking out there fucking. I didn't smoke in that car, by the way. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> out there digging through the ashtray looking for kills. Uh, Patty. Oh, that's giving me anxiety. Dude. Thinking about how she was operating. In oh. How many times you were like, shut the fuck up. She's like trying to like <laughs> entice up. him. Like talking about. She drops her bra strap off her shoulder. She's talk- all right. She's talking about friends of my cousins to you like still know Debbie to like make yeah like make it more like you know We're and friends and family. to the point that the dude's wife rolled in okay just you know stopped to see her husband on a Saturday this guy owns the joint and um, the wife didn't know my mom they, my hi I'm there you know I I hear stories about uh, you know him and. You know, Fred. Yeah. Him and Fred talk all the time. And the guy's like, well, I don't really know Fred that well. I know <laughs> I know his brother or something uh-huh. like that. I'm like, Patty, get the fuck away from me. So he's sitting there. He's running the thing again. OK, I'm sitting there with him. All right. So I'm strike one. OK, he went to some loan people, whatever it is. All right. So now he's running it with 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 Christ. You ended up with a Gambino crime family loan. <laughs> Who do, who give it who gave it to you? He went and got your money on the street. No no institution would give it to you. Chrysler gave it to me. Bozos didn't they tank in the early two thousands? They're giving money away. Those fucking idiots. That's how you cocus. But here's the capper. I'm listening. It's a tense situation. This guy's running my credit score for the fucking second time. Mm-hmm. Okay. My mother disappears, and then reappears with a paper plate. And a plain uncooked bagel on it with mustard squirted on, onto the thing. Okay? You're following me? As you're about to sign, like, a $56,000 contract? Yeah. Okay? Mustard. And I go, where the fuck did you get that? And she's like, they're over there. Like, you know, like they would have, like, a customer service. I'm aware. But they didn't. Because five minutes later... A guy walks over and goes, did you guys see a bagel? So it was over by the coffee stuff. Like coffee the guy was, was getting a bagel, ran, his phone some ran, guy, he left his bagel. He, let, he was getting a coffee, something happened, and he walked away from it. And my mom just took the fucking bagel. And put mustard on it? And put mustard on it. No, I think the mustard, he was his. Who puts mustard on a bagel? This whole thing doesn't make any sense. I don't know, but she was just... fucking dipping it in mustard. I mean. And the guy doesn't say anything. She goes, oh, did you guys see a bagel? She's got mustard all over. (laughs) Has anybody seen mustard in a bagel? She's covered in poppy seeds. She ate some fucking dude's lunch. Because the guy, without even... So, what kind of fucking Fugazi-ass dealership is this? The the owner's there on the weekend. The head salesman eating mustard bagels. Your mom's stealing it. They're giving you a call. What's going on here, dude? This place sounds insane. He doesn't even look up from the computer. He goes, don't worry about that. And I'm fucking just staring at my mother. This has like this sounds like you're in a trailer. I'm not gonna like one of those fucking used car lots. That's where I got the Montego. Out of my fast Uncle Eddie's place. I swear to God. It's I could sell fucking popsicle to a and white gloves. So then it comes back, I got I got a proof for it. This is the this is what it's gonna be, this, that, the other thing. Fucking okay. whatever. So then I gotta get any insurance. Right? Mm-hmm. Getting the insurance. So she's on the phone with them. Who? Patty. To get you your insurance? Yes. To like, because it's, it's with uh, USAA. And since th- my dad is the service member, it's for service members and their families. Sure. So they, she's got to do the intro. Geico originally did that, too. That's what Geico stands for. What? Government Employees Insurance Company. Oh. Damn. Shout out. Fox Business School. Really, they really slummed it, huh? I'm a Geico man. Are you? Yeah, got Not that bad. Geico. He's we a have a reasonable shit. rate, you and I. We was about the same. Well, yeah, it depends. Yeah, the bank makes, if you're leasing the car, the bank makes you cover Cover high. more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I cover more. Um, 
But I forgot about that little accident that I had uh, two years ago. Because they quoted me the thing. When you hit the delivery guy. No, the delivery guy hit me. Okay. Hit me. Okay. Hit me. The intersection of Foleyville and reality. (laughs) I'm just getting Chipotle. Um, When they brought that up. Because they gave me a quote. Like, oh, wait a minute. No accidents? And I'm like, no, I'm good. And he's like, what happened on October 19th at 5.42 p.m.? And they know, like, the street corner. Yeah, they they did. They got me 57 at first. So... Um, dropping the, then now picking up the car was fantastic, mm-hmm. but very sad leaving Laddie. Sure. But the excitement of uh big black. Yeah. yeah. Right, there's a little more. So the guy that was helping me, not the owner, but the other guy. Mm-hmm. Okay. Says, you know, you go clear it, you know, I'll pull the thing up, whatever. It comes around. I'm taking the stuff out of the car and he goes, sir, are you crying? What? What is wrong with you? Dude, that car got me through fucking so much, man. That the little guy. I wish I could take her, take her with me, but I couldn't, and I couldn't pass up on. I wish that I could just keep her as a car. Just have stop it. calling it her. I get very emotionally attached to the cars. Yeah, why? I don't know. All right, relax. I just know. asking. Yeah, and I was I was tearing up a little bit, and I just said, <laughs> "You any mustard?" What the fuck is wrong with your family? Hey, you were bagels left. I just said, you know, I, I had, you know, I had this car through a bunch of shit and fucking, uh, I'm sad. Yeah, I hit a delivery driver. <laughs> There's fucking Chinese food all over the place. It's like you hit Ping in Seinfeld. <laughs> Got a broad noodle. <laughs> a flat broad noodle. I just said, you know, I was like, whatever. And then he, he was Whatever, like, pussy. <laughs> Give me an English muffin and ketchup, stat. I swear to God, not, <laughs> not skipping a beat. He's like, you got to go back and talk to Jay. I think the quote went up a little bit. <laughs> they saw you coming. I guess so. I didn't even think of it to, to negotiate. What? You're crying? Your mom's stealing bagels? Know, what? You, guys... <laughs> you can't negotiate. Yeah. Yeah. You didn't negotiate. You're but crying. I think you can only negotiate when you buy something. No. I could have got the you, lease cheaper. You for sure can't negotiate yeah. when they credit check fucking dings you and they yeah, you instantaneously know. deny the ins- you. The ins- take my, I'll take my business elsewhere. The insurance dings the you. fuck you will. Your mom's rooting through the fucking cafeteria, the employee fridge. You stink. Eating yogurt. What the fuck? Are you She's got a brown paper bag that says Dan on Half it. a piece of birthday cake. <laughs> Apparently, Ted, <laughs> congratulations, Ted. It's his last day. <laughs> All right, guys. Congratulations mm. on the new car. It's a big step into becoming a man at 58 years old. I'm proud of you. I also took a huge deuce and clogged up the toilet, too. <laughs> that I had to wait in there for, like, three flushes to the point that people were not, because I, I needed it to fill up so I can get it down. Yeah. <sighs> We're gonna do. I don't know. Foley's are gonna foley. Huh? Foley's are gonna foley. Jesus, I mean mustard on a bagel. Yeah. What? Which now that I'm thinking about it, I think she disputed that yesterday when I called her out on it. Yeah, of course. She it wasn't mustard. It was something else. Can I unless ask it was, her? Unless it was cream cheese icing. It wasn't cream cheese. Was it yellow? Yeah. That's why. That's why I said I thought it was mustard. Get her on the horn. And then we got to wrap this up. All right. This was a kooky episode anyway. Let's see if we can get her. She's elusive, too. Yeah, she's stuck in Chrysler. Hi, bud. Hey, Pinhead, let me ask you a question. What? What was, on, what was next to the bagel at the dealership? What were you dipping it in? It wasn't mustard? No, it was um, spicy jalapeno. Spicy jalapeno? Spicy jalapeno yeah. what? Dip. Yeah. Okay. Have you been to Massachusetts recently? No, why? All right. I'll call you later. Lobster from Maine. Where? To, are you... At the mall. I'll talk to you later. Bye. <laughs> At the mall. <laughs> she, go... she going to the pet store? <laughs> 
I gotta call her back. Get to the bottom of that. <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, we gotta wrap it up. We gotta wrap it up. <laughs> no, what? That means like she's. That sounds like she's meeting a guy in the parking lot with a cooler in his trunk. <laughs> Going to get, he was bragging to. I'm going to get lobster from Maine. Where at the mall? <laughs> Woo wee! Oh, ladies and gentlemen, those are those hard feelings, and we love you. Peace.